Hi, this is Michael again, and in this video I want to show you the performance and leg issues the new iPad Air has with our 7. And also thanks a lot for your nice comments in my last video with the hours 7, hours 6, iPad 3 comparison. Really appreciate it, and I hope you enjoy this video as well. Okay, so I'm here in front of the uh, Apple Store in Plaza Catalunya in uh, Barcelona. And um, I played a bit around with the iPad uh, Air here, and um, this is just a Wi Fi version. And I could not recognize a lot of lag here, I'm booting it. I just recognized basically three lags in the whole playing around. Lag number one was when you drag down in the middle of the screen so that you get that the search bar comes up. This, there's this like stuttering when, when you do this. Leg number two was when you are in an application and you close it using your four fingers. Um, here I'm doing the... Yeah, as you see, this, there's no leg in this. And um, so the second one was when you close an app with four fingers. There's a slight leg because the icons pop like um, against you. And the third leg was when you, when you do this, what I just did, when you select an app from the, from the task manager. When you tap on it, then um, you can see that it's kind of a bit, a bit stuttery. So let's see if we can see this three effect in this video. You saw this was just the, the lag from the search, search bar. This was the first one. And now let's see what else. So the performance here is okay. This works quite well. Uh, this took also a bit, a bit a moment to bring up the task manager here okay you, you can't see it in the video so good but when you tap it there's like a slight stutter but you can see it very well in the video now it's I think the video doesn't have enough frames and here but with this you see the at the end the icons pop like back it's not smooth it's it's not how it used to be with OS 6 so I'm playing around a bit with these three things just to show you. I, again, you could see the popping effect very well. Actually, it does not happen when you use the home button to um, to minimize an application. It only happens when you use the four fingers pinch. Okay, here this was also an issue in the past. Well, in the past on the I was on the iPad 3. I did the test before. So changing wallpapers is quite quick now, as you can see. So this works well in the iPad Air. Yeah. It looks okay in the video, but when I tested it in the App Store, you could see that it's sort of 100%. Yeah, here you can see it a bit. And here, the popping of the thing always. This is a bit of a quick look around in the App Store. And what I also added now to the end of this video is basically I wanted to show you what what I found out was what works really well now is Evernote because I remember on, on my iPad 3 um, this what I'm doing right now here was very laggy. So if you own an iPad 3 you know what I'm talking about that they this tiles popped up a bit sluggish, stutterish when you click them and this goes very smooth now. So this looks much better. Okay, thanks a lot for watching. This was it and um, as you can see the iPad Air is uh, much quicker than the iPad 3 in terms of iOS 7 performance. Um, but there are still three noticeable lags and um, I hope Apple will fix those soon as well. Alright, and I will also do another video for the iPad 3 as soon as there is um, a later release for iOS 7 out who might maybe bring us some performance improvements here, here and there and then I will do another comparison. Alright, thanks a lot for watching, I hope you enjoyed it and see you in the next video.